So let's talk about the future a little bit. Um, you have something known as a turbo study that you are just launching. Tell me about that. The turbo study, yes. Something we are thrilled and excited about. It. Um, so the the first 12 years of 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 uh, of singer has been has been somewhat of a normally aspirated um story um a big part of the folklore and the mythology behind the the air cool Porsche 911 of course is turbocharging in 1974 Porsche introduced the 930 turbo um as as their luxury grand touring um supercar this new term supercar was used started to get used i remember in 1975 as i was buying car magazine and auto car and motor magazine supercar i thought well, what's a supercar and of course a supercar was a ferrari berlinetta boxer it was a lamborghini countach and it was the porsche turbo and to many people of my age and my generation and perhaps many generations the quintessential Porsche 911 has been the 930 Turbo. That was it. Was certainly it was certainly on my it was a certainly poster on my wall in the 1970s, um, and many others. And um, perhaps it's odd that Singer has 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 become known for for its work on the Porsche 911 for a version of the 911 which perhaps isn't the best known version of the early 911s that we that we've celebrated for the last 12 years are perhaps the lesser known of the breed and the uh the the rock star has uh, was always the 930 turbo and of course it was a fascinating fascinating pivot by porsche in the mid 70s to go from this delicate slim hipped um um uh, dainty sports car to this muscular rubber draped monster of a flared wheel arch low and 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 menacing car the car the car took on a very different demeanor um porsche for me in the 1970s was synonymous with rubber black rubber beautifully molded black rubber which 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 ran around the perimeter of the whale tail ran around the bumpers wrap these bizarre kind of bellows that 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 that, that were meant to squish together in case the in case the car was hit at, at, at low speed and the bumper could bounce back they called them impact bumpers which were part of, of course all instigated through the american legislation at the time which required cars to survive um low speed impacts and of course it, it had this profound effect on this icon which had, i mean the 911 was absolutely an icon in 1974 it was about 10 years old and it, it had you know it, 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 Porsche had, 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 had enjoyed much success from it and here they had to reimagine their delicate little sports car into something that was rather different and 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 the the poster child for that was the turbo which was the wide the wide bodied version and this was uh, this has been a car that our clients have been talking to us about for a long time a car that's very dear to me a car that a, a car that fascinated me that i didn't necessarily want i've never wanted a porsche turbo which mm. is which is quite i've wanted many other 911s but not, so here the, and then of course the seed was sown so how, how can we come up with something that i want <laughs> <laughs> and 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 that's what we've done and 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 so this is the first 930 turbo that um that that um that uh, that is pre presented um in a way that 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 i think i hope celebrates the original and takes it to takes take moves it on but here here we are um uh, presenting a, a a study where we will take the 964 Porsche 911 that we that we that we that we know and love, and uh, restore and reimagine it to, to celebrate the 930 Turbo from the from the from the, the mid 1970s. Um, again, a car for, a, a car for us which which um, celebrates speed, forced induction, refinement, grand touring. 
um, quite different from the classic um, car that uh, again we've we've become we've become known for, and a good complement to that car, I think, um, and um, a, just a different flavour of Porsche 911 from a different era, and of course motivated by a very very different engine, and of course the possibilities for us to do our thing with such a with such a with such a prospect were, were so tantalising, and so so what what we show today is is the result of about eighteen months, two years of of, of study, and um, and um, and we hope we 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 sincerely hope everyone everyone likes it, and um, we're very proud of it. Well, and in fact. Uh, the car will be running at the Goodwood Festival of Speed in England from June 23rd to the 26th. It will then travel to the Monterey Peninsula in Northern California for what we hope <laughs> will be Car Week in August of 2022. So uh, yes. very exciting.